After this, there is no turning back. You take the blue pill. The story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe. Back with another video. I am your host, Chris. Welcome to my two Satoshis. And today I want to go over something real quick with you guys on how to sell your Cardano NFTs. The first thing you're going to want to do is set up your wallet on cnft.io or link your NAMI wallet with the platform. Once you've set up all your good stuff, put in your got your profile up to date and everything, you're going to want to come over and first create a wallet. Add wallet. And you can do one of two things. Following the, this, these steps over here on the right, we'll set up a wallet on the platform. So you can send 2.69815 ADA or whatever price they tell you at that time to the address you see listed and you have until this timer ends to execute that. Send the exact displayed amount, ADA amount to the wallet and address provided. Please ensure your payment is complete before the timer ends. And as it also says, you cannot send this from an exchange. You need to send this from either uh, another wallet like Dateless, Uroy, NAMI, or whatever. Or, as it says here, you can connect with your, your NAMI using the button provided. You can click NAMI here, and it will bring up your NAMI wallet, and you can just sign and connect with it, just like I already have mine. So let's just give you an idea of two different ways you can do it. You can either create a wallet on the platform that you can send your items to, or you can connect with your NAMI wallet. And in doing so, you don't have to send it your, your NFTs to the platform. You can actually hold them in your NAMI wallet where you have complete control over it. And then when someone initiates a purchase, then you send it to them. So I'm going to show you what that looks like, but I want to make sure you guys understand when you have purchased your NFTs from whether or not it's a drop or whatever, you can do it straight from your NAMI wallet. But if you, let's say you want to do it from a Daedalus or your Roy wallet, what you would do then is once you have them in your wallet, you can then send them to your NAMI wallet and interact with the platform, but you still maintain control. You cannot do that from, from Dateless or your Roy. You can't link them to the platform. You can only link the NAMI wallet. As you see here, that button is right here on the left-hand side. It's there for a reason. So if you've gotten that, let's keep it, let's keep it moving. Okay, so now I've got an order in, and what I would do is I would come over here to notifications. I can see, I, I thought I had caught all my pending sales, but I have one more that I can use to actually show you guys how this goes and which pending sale. I think it's this one right here. So I click the pending sale, I click view, and it will show me whether or not I've already completed the sale or not. This is how it looks when you when you want to send an asset. It tells you to send an asset asset to this address, right? I then come over. This is fiat currency. I then come over and open up my NAMI, my NAMI wallet. Click the button on the right right here. And as soon as it comes up, I can just simply choose the fiat currency. Click send, put in the address that was provided. And it did this earlier, but all you do is just come back out and do it again. Choose that, send. Wait for it to get through loading. Put the address in that it's going to. If you have more than one, it will give you the option right here to put one or two or however many you're sending to that person. You simply click send.
thing. Confirm with your password. And trans <laughs> transaction submitted and simply wait. Just give it a couple of seconds. Normally it takes probably less than a minute, really, actually. Now I'm going to show you what it looks like um, when they are actually when it's actually completed. Let's, let's say pending sale, like what I just did. As soon as it completes, if you want to know whether or not you actually did send the right one or if it went through or whatever, you go back to your pending sale and when you click view, it will tell you that that particular item was already sent and congratulations, you finished your sale. Now, I hope I'm not moving too fast and I confuse you guys, but I'm trying to make sure that I go over it enough times to where you get it. So how do you know if it's been sold? Well, I just kind of click around a little bit and it'll display a message on the screen and let you know that the sale. Now, I'm not sure if you could hear that, that's normally how I know. I'll get a notification in my e in my inbox. And I can always go back and check right here also. And this is the one the ends in 397 that's actually pending. It's still going through. I just normally click around a little bit and kind of wait or I'll go do something else. But if I want to know for sure, I always go back to the pending site pending. And when it goes through, it'll come up and tell you that it's, and there you have it. Congratulations, it's been sent. Now, I hope, I, hopefully I explained it slowly enough where you guys got it. Um, for people who are very experienced in this, this is, no, I understand this is not a video for you. But for guys who are new, who have bought a Cardano NFT, and you're not sure how to sell that NFT, this is how you do it on the cnft.io platform now there's also a platform called token.io that you can send it to over there and what you would want to do is simply log in and send your items to this platform to make the sale actually i don't want to confuse you guys so let's just keep it real simple i'll stop there if anyone has any questions about how to sell it on token.io basically what you would be doing is it's a similar process but just a little bit different so i'm going to go ahead and keep this video very short and end it right there if you like this type of content please hit that like that share and the subscribe button and we will be back with you with another video real soon and we're out Stay in Wonderland.